Hello friends, welcome to Insight Learners. So in this video, we shall discuss the test pattern and the selection process for the Turbo in INC. So as discussed, the job role it is for associate software engineer. So the salary it is 12 to 18 lakhs per annum. So the selection process or the different rounds that are included are so there are four different rounds. So the first round it's an online te technical test and which will be conducted online. And the round two it is technical interview one and the round 3 technical interview 2 so there will be two technical interviews and the last round will be the managerial or it can be HR interview so these are the four rounds which are included in the selection process so then first round so online technical test so the test platform so it will be conducted on hacker rank test so once shortlisted you will be getting the link for the test so there will be coding questions so the number of coding questions are 3 and the complexity so there will be two easy coding questions and one medium questions so you can code in any of the programming language you prefer so you can use either java python c c plus plus whichever is preferred and then to qualify for the first round so you need to solve complete two easy coding question and one medium that is you need to pass half of the test cases to qualify for the next round so once you clear the first round so you'll be getting the invitation for the next one that is technical interview one so in the technical interview so there will be initial discussion on resume so whatever you have mentioned in the resume so you'll be asked questions on that your skills your hobbies and all and which language you are comfortable so programming language so based on that the questions will be asked so be prepared with some of the technical questions like oops concepts and then data if you prefer java so as they are looking for java developer itself so you need to be strong in java programming so be prepared on oops concepts then data encapsulation in java and how it is achieved so you need to explain with the program and then collections in java and you should be strong in data structures and algorithms so various algorithms you need to know at least the code snippet of that and some of the sql queries and the coding question so you can practice from lead code or geeks for geeks and in the technical interview also you'll be asked coding question so in which you'll you need to write the logic for that or you need to explain them with the code snippet so like coding question so this was the coding question which was asked from lead code so similar question was asked like house robber so you are a professional robber planning to rob houses along a street so each house will have a certain amount of money stash so this is it's related to arrays so like you can just go through the example and uh, whatever is the input and based on that what is the output so you can go through that and write the logic so you'll be given an integer of array numbers which represents the amount of money of each house you need to return the maximum amount of money you can drop tonight without alerting the police so the adjacent are the police so here they are mentioned robbing each of them and is that adjacent houses you have security systems which is connected and it will automatically contact the police so without considering the adjacent so you need to match the output so these are the number of integers so which is which represents an array so there are four digits one two three one so output is you need to display the output four so thing is like how you need to rob you need to see without touching the adjacent houses so you need to choose the alternate number so starting from position one so first you need to start from position one so the integer is one and then next thing is you need to without touching the adjacent you need to choose the next one so you need to choose the number from the next position so the second position 0 1 2 so you need to check after adding everything whether it reaches the output so if it reaches so you can just uh, add those array and uh, just display the output so this was the interview question this was the coding question which was asked in technical interview and then similarly there will be the next round will be the technical interview so in the round two also you'll be asked on resume and project so whatever you have done in the project and what is your contribution everything it will be asked in technical interview two so in technical interview two so in the technical interview one so they will ask questions basic coding questions on arrays and everything and in technical interview two so it will be hard like they will ask questions on data structures and algorithms so you need to be strong in data structures and algorithm like various binary search algorithm and all 
so this was one of the question which was asked in technical interview to like you need to find the maximum sum of nodes in the binary search tree such that no two are adjacent and they also give the steps to solve the problem so based on that you need to write the code for that and you need to show to them so this was the technique uh, coding question which was asked in technical interview too and after that last round will be the managerial round so in that you need to give a brief introduction about yourself and they will ask some of the scenario based questions and also behavioral questions so these are the questions and the selection rounds that are included in the selection process of taru so there are some more questions which was asked in technical interview so we'll add those links in the description you can go through the same and prepare on the same so thank you friends for watching and do subscribe our channel for more updates